About a month ago, when we were reading the Gospel of Mark at Daily Mass, I was struck by how many times it mentioned that crowds of people flocked to Jesus. Hello, this is Father James Kubicki, and I thought of this today because of the saint we're celebrating. In the second reading in the breviary, an excerpt from an early biography says that people flocked from all directions to St. Francis of Rome, a wife and mother who died in 1440. As crowds flocked to Jesus, so they flocked to this woman who was a reflection of Jesus. That's what you're called to be as well, someone who reflects Jesus to the world. That's what it means to be a Christian. So, as you listen now to an excerpt from her biography, ask God to help you have the virtues that are described here. God had not chosen her to be holy merely for her own advantage. Rather, the gifts he conferred upon her were to be for the spiritual and physical advantage of her neighbor. For this reason, he made her so lovable that anyone with whom she spoke would immediately feel captivated by love for her and ready to help her in everything she wanted. Divine power was present and working in her words so that in a few sentences she could bring consolation to the afflicted and the anxious, calm the restless, pacify the angry, reconcile enemies, and extinguish long-standing hatreds and animosities. Again and again, she would prevent a planned revenge from being carried out. She seemed able to subdue the passions of every type of person with a single word and lead them to do whatever she asked. For this reason, people flocked to Francis from all directions as to a safe refuge.